everyone, this is Christy. Today I'm going to show you my first traveler's notebook that I made. I made this one recycling a pair of denim from my daughter and I decorated with some uh, laces in ivory color and also a rosette trim. And I really love the way that it came out because it has a pocket right here and I have a pen and also I had some washi tape that I took um, for my trip and now I only have a few more and then right here I put this beautiful lace with hearts at the bottom and this is an elastic an elastic lace and this one was part of the waist and I just cut it in and put it in there so I can use this elastic to close the traveler's notebook and then right here this one, uh, I had to take it, it was on the very top and I just glue it right here so I could um, hang something and I bought this one at, and I bought this keychain at um, New York where I went and I really love it because it looks like it has a lot of charms in there, see? So right here at the back, it looks like this, this is part of the leg of the denim so it looks plain the size is like about six by nine the papers are five and a half by eight and a half okay inside but the size of the cover is like about six by nine so when you open i cover it with a paper i love this paper because it's velvety and right here i, I put a picture of us and this is at the airport of Los Angeles and it was my two sisters and my two brothers and my little nephew and my daughter and we went to New York to see uh, the concert of another nephew who was already there and um, he's a pianist and we went there for four days only but it was very fun because all of us were together brothers and sisters so we had a very amazing time then i used some um stickers that says new york and everything about new york and i bought it at michael's and it's by paper house so it was enough for this traveler's notebook and i distribute in all of the pages See, it has like these arrows, titles, was very, very fun to use them. So this is a little tag that I had in my stash. And right here I put the boarding passes. And here is a picture when we just got there. And this is me and I'm pointing to New York. See? <laughs> and, and I'm pointing to the store that says New York and then right here um i had this um i had a lot of tags that i found for traveling and i just journal something and this is the group of us um and we and we are arriving to the airport then right here my brother took a selfie we are closer there and then i used um washi tape to put it in there okay see like a waterfall mat so it's easier to put a lot of pictures in there so this is a postcard and then um, I use copy paper a scrapbook paper and a lot of stickers that I had in my stash so this is a fun uh, picture I put formality versus reality this is a formal picture of all of us and this is the reality of how we look so happy in there right so and right here there is a picture that i took of a wallpaper in one of the restaurants and it looks like a postcard but um what i love on new york is that they have art everywhere so there is a lot of uh, wallpapers painted everywhere <laughs> So you will see a lot of them here. So I made like a postcard and at the back I put some uh, paper to put the information of the hotel that we stayed in. And then um, this is the key of the room. I asked if I could keep it and they said yeah because they tossed it away. So um, I kept 
that one and right here there is the pocket and I, I was telling you like this is a store and you see this is the door and there is a painting of John Lennon with Yoko Ono right here then this one is on the on the wall as well on our walks so right here this is the first day that uh, we just arrived and then we went uh, to Central Park which is uh, which was like blocks away from the hotel and it was snowy it didn't snow those days but I think it did before so it was some snow on the floor it was very very cold so right here we are there see can you see some snow in there so all Central Park looked like that <laughs> see and I had like two hats right here and I was with this um, jacket that I used for snow. <laughs> I knew that it was so cold. <laughs> and right here, there was a um, playground. And there were children playing in there. It was so super cold. I couldn't believe it. <laughs> so right here is my brother and his son. And this is what you see all the... From Central Park, you see all the um, buildings and with lights. It was a very nice scene. We came back late when everything was dark, super dark. Then uh, in the morning, we went to grab some coffee. And this is a famous um, franchise at New York. And it's Gregory's Coffee. And I put some pictures right here. I made like a pocket. This is the sleeve. And I just put hot glue in the center. And then right here... There are some pictures like this was my coffee and the snack and then right here is us and my brother and my sister so i put some pictures i have a lot more pictures to put but um i didn't feel it yet so the, you will see a lot of empty spaces see um beautiful views that i took pictures lots of bridges and this is like the buildings everything that you see in the movies <laughs> and i took a picture of this newspaper because it says the new york times and also it has a date and everything and the highlights of the news that it was so cold freezing cold nearby all the areas so that those were the news and um, we rented a car and we were passing by michael's and i said stop slow down i need to look at picture of michael's in new york and i really wanted to visit that store but it, we didn't have no time so um, it was only for four days and we had all our itiner itinerary so there was no time but um Okay, at least I have the picture of Michael's. And then right here, uh, the gift shops everywhere for buying souvenirs. And then the yellow cabs um, everywhere. So New York. And then the Times Square Church was near the hotel. And then right here, these are the buildings with the emergency exits on outside. So, so fun to see everything like that see and then we went to the american museum of natural history and i took a picture of the entrance right here there are some yellow cows in there here are the tickets and then right here this is a postcard and i have a pocket right here and i put guide map and then right here um this is not done yet i just put some pictures that i want to but i couldn't find my washi tape anymore um i put with washi tape one picture of me and right here the dinosaurs um bones and the fossils right and then um you i use washi tape here and i was going to do a waterfall right here i just put the first one it's going to look like this see and then you can flip all the pictures and then i was going to journal at the end okay right here but i can find my washi tape <laughs> i was running out of them okay um then right here i didn't finish journaling but this is outside and this is the entrance and as you can see right here it's like this way 
this is the side and we took a picture outside and this is my daughter and my sister and then right here some more pictures of the dinosaur bones and then look at this sticker it's the um, statue of liberty and it says one day can change everything and yeah that's really true because every time you learn more and you see more your life changes and something happens in your um perspective uh, of viewing things right so here's the yellow cow and right here i had this pocket and i put these um postcards that i bought um and this one has all uh, dimensions of the statue and this is the view so it was really a nice experience um staying there and knowing more about that then right here i have the tickets of the ferry and it says uh for statue of liberty and ellis island and then right here i have a picture up here of my my daughter and my brother and his son and i made a pocket i just glued the edges right here and i'm going to journaling at the back then right here a postcard i took more pictures but um i just put the postcards for now but um i'm going to keep filling all these travelers notebook with more pictures then right here from the ferry i took a picture of my daughter on the side and then i took a picture of the skyline you see all the buildings right here and we were in the ferry so it was very very nice see? then i'm going to put more pictures right here have a lot of empty pages then a pocket and right here this is another section and in this section i put everything about the concert and this one um was at carnegie hall and this is the picture of it i took a picture in the day see here are the flags and this is the entrance right here and i put new york there is no place like it this is these are stickers that come with that set of stickers and right here um the day of the concert the concert was at night but in the morning we had the option to have a tour and pay um an extra fee i went with my daughter my brother and my nephew to to have a tour and it was a very amazing history behind that place and here is a picture of us and here is where they um, make the show and right here you can see a little more and here is the dome where is the show and these are all the seats but it's a beautiful beautiful nothing compared with these <laughs> dark pictures <laughs> but it's just a referral of uh, how it looks okay then i printed in vellum paper right here the building and i'm going to write more and put up more pictures then right here i put a picture of my little niece and this is my nephew's daughter and her name is hannah and she's the future pianist at carnegie hall she loves music she can't stay without music i mean uh, my my nephew plays piano every day and she's used to listen to music so here is carnegie hall at night and you can see beautiful how it looks with the lights and my daughter took a picture of it and here is us my brothers sisters and me right here and this is the day of the concert and this is my nephew who play there and then here are the tickets and then right here and this is the brochure i'm not going to share that because it's too much information <laughs> and here is a friend of my nephew who was going to give a concert to and she's holding hannah my baby niece and she's playing she loves being there in the lap while somebody's playing so she was there and then after 
after the concert, we went to the hotel, stayed in the lobby, and spent hours talking about everything. And it was so, so fun. Here is my brother and my nephew. And here is his um, wife and Hannah. See? And I'm going to put more pictures later. And right here. Um, we went to Broadway. I took a lot of pictures there. And as you can see, buildings and the yellow cabs. And this is uh, my daughter's favorite store. So I had to take a picture of her. And then uh, we went to eat at Applebee's. And inside of the, um, the restaurant, there was um, all the wall decorated, painted right here with um, beautiful paintings from related to New York. And I just took a picture of that. And then here there are envelopes. And this is a New York Minute. <laughs> See, here is the police in a horse and then the yellow cab. Like in the movies. <laughs> I had to take a picture of that <laughs> when I saw it. Then here is an envelope. And here is when we went to the World Trade Center. And right here, this is a mural again and it was so beautiful and here is my daughter and right here in the next page we are at the world trade center the entrance of the museum and then right here i have this uh, postcard that says times square then right here there is another mural like this in the world trade center and then right here, it's us by the um, uh, memorial. And the memorial looks like this. There are two of them, but um, this is the picture of one. It's a big empty space where the Twin Tower was. This is the base. And then right here, there is um waterfall and in La Capu at the bottom. And all the names of the people who were down are written right here all around. It was a very sad moment to be around that place. And then here is another uh, painting. It's a mural again. Another postcard. And then here is us in Jersey City. And my brother took us there to see new york from the other side of the hudson river so it was a very nice sightseeing and we just stopped at starbucks and bought um some souvenirs there that says new york so I was so happy in there and then i i need to film more pictures and then the last one is when we were to the rockefeller center and here is my sister with all the flags at the entrance. And I, we found the Peruvian flag, of course. Yay! <laughs> you know that I'm Peruvian, right? So then here is a pocket for postcards or pictures or more. And then at the end, I put um, these two small tags and I glue right here. And made a pocket so here are the boarding passes and here I have another pocket and more postcards see so this is how it looks um my traveler's notebook and as I said it's very very sturdy okay and I'm going to make the tutorial and show you how I made it. You can recycle a pair of jeans, denim, in any color. So if you want to make one of these, stay tuned for the tutorial, okay? So thank you very much for watching my videos, for your likes, your comments, and for subscribing to my channel. Have a blessed day, everyone. Bye-bye.